All right, so once you've logged in and you become a user, let's go ahead and get started in creating a landing page. So go ahead and click up on the left-hand side here, and we're going to go to build your page right here. So we're going to click that. And I've already created a page, so we can uh, just go off the page that I've created, but we're going to go up to the pages here. And uh, let's see if we can just go. I know yesterday we were going over uh you know step by step but let me do that one more time for you ladies okay so let's go here and of course uh, you can create uh, so when you log in with your username password it should bring you to a page to actually start your main template which is your it could be your business logo it'd be you know I, I put my avatar face right here and then it'll ask you to uh, put in you know your business information and then where you're from and then once you do that, you're able to go ahead and get into the add content right here. Okay, so when you do that, all you gotta do is click on this. And here's all the content types that you can be uploading into your landing page. So it's very robust and it's very easy to use. Uh, now again, uh, if it doesn't say pro on it, um, if it says pro on it, um, that's gonna be a paid service. Okay, so FYI on that. Uh, but if it doesn't have pro on it, you can basically use that function to put into your landing page. So of course, to add, to add uh, this button with a photo, all you gotta do is click on it. And it's pretty uh, user friendly. You just click on the image there. You can add a caption to it. And what's cool about this is you can add a URL link. So how cool is that, okay? Uh, so let me just show you uh, kind of like how I put my landing page together. I, I, made, I made more. To, I made it towards my digital business international business, but I also put the registration for the Solwyn TV in there as well. Okay, uh, so let me go ahead and just go up here. And we're gonna go ahead and just preview the page, so you can kind of see what it, how it functions, right? So when you use your card and you go and and you tap it to another phone, this is basically the landing page that they're gonna see. Okay. And then when they want to connect with you to inside the link app right here, all they got to do is hit connect, put their name, their email address, or their phone number, and hit connect, and you folks are connected. So how cool is that? Uh, okay, so let me just show you so how some of this functionality works with the buttons. So uh, I put in a register for Solwyn TV. Let me click that, and voila, it's going to go right to the Solwyn.tv website. It needs time for it to load up there. There we go. Okay, so this is the starter page for the Solwyn TV, and of course, uh, Alana said that there's going to be more to it uh, in the works here. So of course, if you, uh, we could actually put this as the link for the register, right? We could just take this link right here. Let me go ahead and copy that. Let's go back to the main page, and let me go into the edit right here, and instead of saying Solwyn. TV, I'm going to go ahead and put register right there, okay, paste, save changes, okay, and let's go ahead and click off that, let's go ahead and make this a preview page, okay, so now when we go to register to Solwyn TV, click on that, and boom, you go right to the register, okay, all right, so let's keep going down, uh, so I put my own uh, business uh, design studio website on there as well. I put it about myself. Uh, I put photos on here. Now with the photos, this is what I recommend. Definitely put some links to it, right? So if you're going to put a photo of maybe it's a, maybe it's like a, maybe you're selling CBD or whatever. Um, you can put your CBD oil logo on there and then to the website or maybe to the click to purchase on it. So right here, uh, I did uh, basically to my website. So if you want to get into VR, uh, into the DBI website VR, you just click right there and it basically gets you to sign up and then you're just going to visit that page and go right into virtual reality. Okay, so let's go ahead and click off that. Uh, again, you can, you can put links to pictures, but also you can just put um, 
you know, you can just label things and then put the uh, uh, links to those. Uh, so right here I say virtual reality access. And I just call the DBI conference room and breakout rooms. You can put links like that. I like this feature right here, the social uh, links right here. It also has a PayPal. So if you're wanting to, you know, maybe you're a contractor or whatever and someone needs to pay you, you know, to get you, um, to get you started, they can actually uh, pay you right on the PayPal right there. Uh, I like that you can put LinkedIn, Facebook, and your um, YouTube. And of course, here's contact me, uh, which of course right here, this is the connecting within the link app itself, right? But if they want to call you on the phone, right? They would just click that and they get your information right there. Uh, I have it linked to another, I created a, a website inside, um, inside the, uh, uh, the Canva. So of course they can download this information and it goes to a VCF card. So let's go ahead and open that up. Just like that. Let's click on all this. So it's almost like a business card right here. And I like how it's linked to the website here as well. So we can go over to this website. So there's many ways that it connects. And you ladies can do another website uh, just about you, wherever, if you like, through the Canva. And do it that way. I even have the Link Ambassadors program on there. Okay, so let's go ahead and go back. I guess we can just exit out of that. Okay. So it's a very robust uh, landing page. Okay. Now to set up your cards, uh, let's go into the menu. So once you get your card, of course, you're going to activate it. I don't have a card, so um, I think I need to have a code or something or it recognizes that you have the co uh, card next to you. So I'll have to look into this to find out. But let me just click on it and see what it says. Please download the Link mobile application to activate your Link product. Okay, so that makes sense. It's going to be on your phone because your phone has the NFC technology on it. Yep. Okay. Makes sense. So you're going to... You're going to do this on your phone versus on the computer, okay? And then how to use link products gives you tutorial. So if you have Android, it'll tell you, I guess, what devices you can use. Yeah. Oh, look at that. It even shows you how to do it right there. That's pretty easy. This is another thing, the QR code. Uh, I was, uh, I put that as my backdrop on my Zoom. So when people are, when you're networking on Zooms, you can just say, hey, if you want to grab my information, just uh, grab the QR code off my picture, right? So let's, see that we're talking about that, let's go to that right now. So let's go all the way down to where it says link backgrounds for Zoom right here. So you can just go through the ones that you like and then just hit download and then it'll go into your C drive and then you upload it into your virtual platform on your Zoom. So if you need help with that, by all means, reach out to me through Discord. And I can show you how to do that as well. Um, and I know all you ladies are gonna be doing the, the Teams. So that's gonna be good. That's gonna provide a lot of analytics. Uh, you can set up a link pay on there. Uh, and then you can set to receive the SMS uh, upon connection. If you get charged rates, I guess you can turn that off so you don't get charged for text rates and stuff like that. And then, okay, support, and it looks like, and that's pretty straightforward. Now let's go over to the network. So of course you can create communities inside. So uh, it's almost like a closed Facebook. You can just explore the links for on the first communities right here. And it looks like you can create a community within. That's pretty cool. Connections. Okay, link headquarters. Just looking through all this. So it definitely takes some time to go through it and click on all the, the buttons there and spend some time on it. And it's pretty user-friendly. 
So let's go into the analytics. So I like how it shows how many clicks. You know, so it does give a um, a click level, which is interesting. Then notifications. Request you will receive connection requests with when someone connects with one of your link pages. Okay. All right. So you get a notification. Now let's go back into the menu. It looks like you can download to view the analytics. And that's pretty much it. So let's go back to the pages. And on a free account, you can create two pages. So this is my, I created the Basically has a Solwin TV in my DBI business design studio all wrapped into it. So this is the link that I'll be sending out. So if you want to send out the link, you can go right like this, share the page. And you can copy it to your clipboard, you can put it in an email, you can do it in a text, or you can download the QR code and send it to somebody. So let me go ahead and clip it like that. Go into my social media. And let's see how it correlates on the Facebook. So let me go ahead and put it right there. Right click, paste it. Just like that. So that's that's a very nice landing page for social media. Let me go ahead and post it. So many ways you can put your link app link out into uh, the digital world. And if you ladies have any more questions about this, by all means, reach out to me. Happy to assist with it. And I uh, hope you have a great day and blessings to all.